thought it was a friend. It's literally just reminding me to do government. That's my life. Hey you guys, what's up? It is Andrew. And as you can tell by the title of this video, this is going to be about my sexuality. I decided to pick this one as kind of my first update regarding my transition because I think that for me personally, it was the one that was the most shocking for one. And I feel like if I kind of talk about it, then if I talk about other things that kind of concern my sexuality or an experience or whatever, then I won't have to explain it then because you already know. Over the past year, I kind of realized I don't really have a sexuality. So I guess it would be easier if we started more from the beginning. I figured out probably my sophomore year of high school that I really liked girls. I figured it out, I came out my junior year and I thought like, bam, I'm set. So then that went on for a while and I only dated girls until probably last year. So coming up to last year, I started to kind of question my sexuality. I would see guys and it wasn't so much like before of whenever I'd see a guy and I would just kind of recognize like, oh yeah, I mean, they're good looking. Like I would totally like to be like them. It was kind of like, so I just kind of went with it. I was open. I was like, I don't really care if I've been straight, I guess you would say. Yeah, I don't really care if I've been straight for the past year. This is what I'm feeling and I'm gonna totally just go with that. So I figured it out and I actually really do like guys. I mean, of course there are like certain types of guys that I'm attracted to and certain types of guys that I'm not. There are definitely certain types of girls I'm attracted to and certain types of girls that I'm not. That's just with people, but there are guys I'm attracted to and there are girls I'm attracted to. I have noticed that some months I'll notice more girls and some months I'll notice more boys and that's totally fine with me. I think that you should just do you. Don't worry about what other people think or say because that's what I'm doing right now and it's working out really well for me. I'm really happy and I don't feel this pressure about what other people think about it. Also, a fun little fact for you, my dad actually talked to a woman that had her PhD in psychology and she was saying uh, it's actually very typical for people to transition and then re-explore their sexuality because all of your hormones change. You kind of change as a person and the way that you perceive things and the ways that you think about things, just your mental thought process and your beliefs, a lot of things just change. And so kind of how other people view you and treat you changes as well. And so I think some of that attraction can change. So they're actually studying now to see if being gay just means being gay. Being gay might not necessarily mean that you are attracted to to like male or female and so if you're a female attracted to another female you're gay or if you're a male attracted to another male then you're gay it, it might be something that you're either just born gay or you're not meaning when you're born you might just like the way it feels when somebody understands you and it might be that whenever you transition from female to male that males understand you now more so that's more what you're attracted to or if you're a male and you transition to female then you know you start getting female emotions and you feel like females understand you more and you feel more comfortable with them so it might just be that you like the same it doesn't it might not necessarily mean that you were born liking girls or you were born liking guys and i feel like a lot of people think it is that way and it might be that way but i just think it's kind of cool to think that it might not be i don't know it's just something cool to think about and you can totally disagree if you want you can leave your opinion down below and, you know, just chat about it or, you know, see what other people think about it. I think sexuality is so cool because it is very flexible and it's just kind of the way that you interpret things. So that's just kind of how I feel about it. That's where I'm at. I'm not really labeling myself. So there you go. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later. Bye. My relationship with guys then, I just... This cat, jeez.